Hey everybody, it's Sam again. Sorry for the lack of videos today. Um, I've not been feeling that well, but I thought I'll I'll put one video out at least anyway. This is just going to be a cold boot, so batteries are both taken out of both the phones. And then we're going to be doing a quadrant standard, and then do a limb pack. So uh, this is going to be a fair test. So what I'll do is I'll put the back batteries back into both phones first of all. And we'll put the back on. And that's the Galaxy S2 ready. And the sensation. So, this is going to be the first kind of duel, you know, phone versus phone. I've had quite a few requests um, for, these, for these tests, so we'll see how it goes. So, to turn them on, the easiest way is going to be to hold it like this. So you can see it's a fair test. And one, two, three. That's it, both phones should be turning on. So let's see which wins the, the boot up first of all. Again, this is going to be a class of like three rounds. Yep, so it'll be three rounds. So basically this is the first boot up. So we'll see which one loads to the lock screen and they can unlock it. And we'll see what one gets to the home screens first of all. And it looks like the Galaxy S2 could be the winner here. So we'll just wipe it off, and it is. So we'll just wait for the sensation to for the catch up. And there we go. And the sensation's got there as well. And we'll just unlock it. It's loading up the, the home screens for me. And there we go. So first test. Galaxy S2 um, has actually won this one. What I will do is I'll turn the brightness down on the here, um, so, it, so it doesn't look like it's a bit squiffy like it does on screen at the moment. So put the brightness down. Should look okay on camera, and we'll just make sure that the Galaxy is around the same one as well. What are you doing, Sam? There we go. Right, Sam, so happy with that. So, we shall zoom into the screen so you get a bit of a better view. Right, so let's say the first test is going to be quadrant standard. So, I'll just get to quadrant on both phones. I believe it's there. And it's there. So, we'll go into the application. And now we'll do the, the actual full benchmark. So hold it and let go. And we'll see which one gets to the end first. Obviously we'll see which one gets the highest scores. So yeah, um, thanks for everyone that's been watching the videos. Um, I know I do keep saying it, but I do really appreciate it. So also thank you very much for that. Um, I've been overwhelmed by the, the actual support you guys have offered. Um, so yeah, let's see which one wins out of these two here. As we as we know, they're both running a 1.2 gigahertz dual core processor. One on the left hand side, the Galaxy S2, is running Samsung's own, I think it's Exynos processor. Well, this is running a Qualcomm Snapdragon dual core processor. This phone has one gigabyte of RAM, and the sensation it has 768 megabytes of RAM. So as you can see, um, the sensation finished it slightly before the Galaxy S2. But the all important thing is to what the scores are going to be. Right, so we'll bring the sensation up first of all. And if we can get it to focus, you should see it's 1928. Hopefully that's showing on there. Oh, power save just turned itself on. We'll turn that off in a moment. So that didn't affect the, the actual quadrant benchmarks. And the Galaxy S2, if it wants to is 3,247 you can see that hopefully you can so in that test there the Galaxy S2 um, has won again so it's not looking good for the sensation so far but let's see if it can redeem itself in limb pack so first I'm just going to turn off the power saving because there's just enough power in it to do this so it's there Da -da -da. 
and turn off power saving. Right then, so obviously that didn't affect those two, the actual limb pack there, uh, limb pack quadrant. What I'll do now is I'll do the limb pack, which is there and there. So we'll go into limb pack, and as I've done previously, I'll do three runs of this, so it's a fair test. So we shall run the benchmark. The Galaxy S2 gets 45.562. Uh, 1.87 the sensation gets a slightly higher 45.961 at 1.82 seconds both have got the normal res of 5.68 and we should run it again in this one the Galaxy S2 has got 45.611 with a time of 1.84 and the sensation once again has got a slight higher of markage of 46.75 6 at uh, 1.79 seconds and last but not least the Galaxy S2 has got 46.626 at a time of 1.8 seconds and the Sensation has got 46.782 at 1.79 seconds so in, in contrast there the Sensation kind of redeems itself a little bit it does beat out the Galaxy S2 slightly in limp pack um, the overall, you know, onus of both the phones. Um, boot up times clearly was the Galaxy S2. Quadrant, once again, clearly the Galaxy S2. But the sensation did kind of redeem itself a little bit in the Limpack scores. So, in a head to head here, 2 1. The winner will be the Galaxy S2 in performance in terms of boot up and quadrant, and obviously Limpack goes to the sensation. So, thanks for watching. I'll be trying to do some more videos over the course of tomorrow. You know, do more videos head to head like this. So, thanks for watching, and I'll um, see you tomorrow. Bye.